Star Wars The Clone Wars Season 4, Episode Number 9. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here to next week's episode of Clone Wars once again. I believe this is the last episode in the Umbara arc. I just watched Episode 8. I loved it. I don't know if General Krell is going to be sticking around past this arc or what. All I can say is fuck that bitch. And I hope at some point he gets beat. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know if maybe... Because he's doing everything he can to stop them from, you know, succeeding in the mission. And time and time again, Rex and the clones just come through. So I'm wondering if maybe he's going to hit a breaking point where he just, you know, snaps. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm completely wrong. Maybe he's not in Palpatine's pop pocket. Maybe he's just another dude who hates clones and sees them as expendable. So he just sends them down with horrible battle strategy. You know what I mean? Like just shoving clones down the enemy's throat essentially until they outnumber them. You know, maybe that's just his battle strategy. Maybe he's not in Palpatine's pocket, but either way, man, this bitch Krell, I'm pissed as fuck. Um, I, I don't know how this is going to end, man. I know Obi-Wan, we haven't really seen him too much because he's obviously fighting on a different front. Same battle, different front. But uh, this being the last episode of the arc, maybe everybody will finally come together once we uh, kind of take the t take what we're here for. You know what I mean? But regardless, guys, I'm going to stop wasting time. We're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this episode. Before we do, I do ask that if you guys are new to this channel, you do hit that subscribe button. Comment down below what you guys are going to see next, man. Drop a like on the video for your boy. For reaction, to be up on Patreon as well as early access to the next two episodes. If you guys want to check that out, link in the description down below. We're going to go ahead. We're going to hop into this episode. The wise man leads. The strong man follows. They talking about that bitch Krell. I hope they just snap and jump him, bro. Jump that motherfucker. I'm still waiting for Krell to thank us for handing this base over to him. Yep. He ain't never gonna, bro. It seems they're receiving new arm shipments directly from a supply ship orbiting General Kenobi. This shit seems fake as fuck. Difficulty transmit. They must be jamming our signals. My battalion will meet you at the rendezvous coordinates. We cannot expect. <laughs> Trying to get him back, sir. Bro, I don't know that shit. The enemy is jamming our transmissions. We are on our own. This shit seems fake as fuck, bro. That didn't seem like Obi Wan. Like the transmission looked way different. Maybe it's just because we're in a different environment, different tower, different technology. But some seem fishy here. I realize you haven't agreed with all my strategies, Captain. But you are smart enough and loyal enough to obey my orders. Now prep those troops. Fuck you, bitch! I just want Rex to slap the shit out of him, bruh. Everything they do, something else magically comes up. He is not acting like the other Jedi. He has no respect for us. Listen, I don't agree with him either, but I don't have a better plan. What about using these starfighters to destroy the supply ship? We can sneak right past their blockade. Get where our ships can't. If we take out that supply ship, then we cut off arms to the capital. Yeah, now what you gotta say about that, Krell? Oh, I don't think so. We need to push it to the capital. That's what the motherfucker gonna say. I'm afraid I can't afford to waste any clones on frivolous adventures. Yeah, but you can send them down the fucking middle, right? To take the capital. You can't. You can't spare two. You can't spare two, but you can send a fucking hundred down the fucking middle. So that's it. We just march into those missiles. Oh, there's another option. We go ahead with our plan and suffer the consequences. Yep. You would be court-martialed. Come on. If Hardcase can fly one of these things, <laughs> we all can. Yeah, he wasn't really flying. More like <laughs> avoiding crashing. He'll be blasted out of the sky before we get anywhere. I'm sorry. I cannot just follow orders when I know they're wrong. Especially when lives are at stake. You will if you support the system we fight for. I do support it. I do. But I am not just another number. None of us are. Damn right. He doesn't even call you guys by your name. Fives is an OG, man. I hope we don't lose him, too. You know Krell has no respect for him because he doesn't even call him by their name, bro. He just uses their numbers. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, maybe you should have tried this outside. Now they're going to be even more pissed because all this shit's getting fucked up. Hey, I got this. Uh, yes, sir. Everything's fine in the hangar, sir. Uh, nothing's out of control down here. Then why have the alarms been triggered? Ah, oh. Uh, 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 it's just a drill. A uh, safety drill, sir. I'm going 
down there. He's gonna try and kill him, I bet. This might be the breaking point for Rex. It's a malfunction. No harm done. Explain Bitch, this look around. Now. Sir, we were decrypting the enemy craft when what appears to be an enemy booby trap went off. <laughs> a booby trap? <laughs> yes, sir. Well, Captain Rex, looks like I was correct. The Umbaran fighters are dangerous and not fit for flight. But, Damn. Sir. <sighs> Fives, what are you doing out here? You should be in the barracks. I found my pilots. We're going after that supply ship. It's a suicide mission. Not to mention against orders. So is the it's other. The right thing to do. I can't help you when you get caught. Mm. I understand, sir. Damn. Hey, he said he can't help him. He didn't say he was gonna, you know, rat him out though. So that's good. Rex, I, I understand Rex, man. I do. I get where he's coming from with all of this. He's trying to do the right thing, but he's also trying to follow orders. Don't tell me they're going to disobey orders. Well, I didn't say that. You know we have to tell the general. Jesus, no. bro. No, 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 you can't. Then we'll be complicit in that insubordination. Do you really want to be court-martialed? Bro, why are you being a bitch? Look, sir. Hey, they really whipping those things. Look at Rex. He like that. He got that smirk on his face. He like, okay, maybe y'all can fly them motherfuckers. I like Rex, dude. Well, it's better than Krell's plan. That is true, man. Anything's better than that. I'm only doing this because I don't like him. There's reason enough. I'm just doing it for fun. Of course. Damn, it's really going down up here, huh? Damn, it's really popping off up here. Okay, maybe Obi that was a real transmission from Obi Wan. I'm telling you, man, clones come up with some good ass plans. Hey, see, it's good they use this shit. They know what they're doing, baby. Only thing is, they might not get out. Oh shit. Man, this is some bullshit. They were so close, bruh. Yo, you know hard case is crazy. Hard case always be on hard case always be on his shit, man, but No, bro. Wow. Dude, I'm getting chills, man. This is gonna be like another heavy incident, huh? Dude, this is gonna be like heavy 2.0. Sacrificing himself. Wow. Live to fight another day. Wow, bro. Dude, fuck. It's just like when Heavy gave himself up, man, to let everybody else escape back in season one or season two, whatever it was. It was an early episode. Rest in peace, Hardcase, man. God damn. That's sad. Where's Hardcase? He didn't make it. We couldn't have done it without him. One clone, though, compared to how many would have died with the full on attack. General Crow would like to see them in the tower. Mm -hmm. Bro, if Crow's pissed, I'm gonna be pissed. They will be court-martialed. They will be found guilty. And they will be executed. Wow. Make no mistake. For crossing me, you will pay the price. Krell, you gotta be the biggest bitch I ever seen in my life, man. Motherfucker, I ain't never seen a bigger bitch than you. You, oh, dude, I'm so irritated, bro. Like, can we get Anakin back up in this bitch, bro? Like, can we just have some appreciation for how good of a leader Anakin is? Like, this dude, this dude Krell literally doesn't do shit, man. He doesn't come up with any strategy. Every strategy he's ever come up with that, well, okay, obviously, when I say ever, I mean in these two episodes or in these three episodes for that matter, he, that he's ever come up with has been, let's charge them head on at, and meet them at the fucking gates. Like what? 
are you like what that's your plan that's that's a plan anybody could have came up with that my fucking four-year-old nephew could have came up with that you know what i mean <laughs> like the fuck that's not a real plan you know and then every time somebody uh you know recommends a plan to him or suggests a plan to him the motherfucker says no no that's not gonna work this this and that bitch rex has proved time and time again his clones can do it so what the fuck is the issue man this dude just hates clones man and he wants them dead he doesn't want he doesn't want the mission to succeed you know what i mean like maybe maybe he wants the mission to succeed but he just doesn't care about the clones you know because they were saying how like he is successful in his missions but his clone casualty is higher than anybody else in the field man and it just goes to show you dude like crowd really does not care about his men you know he just sees them as expendable which is kind of fucked up dude because clones are clones man like they may be clones but they're still people you can tell you know everyone's got their own personality and everything they got names and everything like that he doesn't even call them by their names you know like hard case man he went out like a fucking g reminded me of the five situation uh not fives but the heavy situation man so rest in peace to hard case dude was a fucking badass and he, he he made sure the mission got fucking completed bro let me know what you guys thought about it in the comment section down below like always also if you guys did enjoy this reaction video make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button for reaction to be up on patreon as well as early access to a bunch of other stuff i'm doing if you guys want to check that out link in the description down below i hope you all have a wonderful day and i'll see you in the next one what is going on everybody i hope you all did enjoy the video that you just watched i want to give a couple quick shout outs to some of my highest supporters over on patreon the homie supernova the homie that's so gordo the homie dude tim and the homie silas kane shout out to you guys for supporting me at my highest tier over on patreon guys link is on screen right now as well as in the description down below to get access to a bunch of cool things such as early access full length reaction polls and tons of other stuff man appreciate all you guys and i'll see you in the next one